Okay, once a week on the show, I like to meet someone who I've always wanted to meet. Uh, often, this would happen to be a very attractive lady. Now, broadcasting regulations forbid me from doing this without some spurious reason attached. We like to call this our celebrity challenge. I have always enjoyed water sports, so I thought I'd indulge myself on the brand new arcade title, Aquajet. Perched precariously on an alarmingly realistic Aquajet, my contestant will speed toward the finishing line before the precious seconds run out. Time extensions are available along the way, as are a number of spectacular jumps, and contestants should avail themselves of both if they're to avoid an early bath. It gives me especially great pleasure to introduce today's guest because I feel like I've grown up with this woman uh, from uh, when I was a very, very young man. I have studied her career very, very closely indeed. Please welcome Sam Fox. It's a pleasure to have you. Hey, thanks for having me. If it's not too premature to say that. <laughs> Sam, uh, there are two big aspects to your career. Yes, uh, there certainly is. You've got the, the modelling and the singing. I want to talk about the singing. You are huge all over the world. Where are your biggest? Um, I would say America is probably my biggest market. Yeah. Japan, um, France. Do you have to translate the names of your singles in different countries? In some cases, um, with certain records I do, for certain territories I do the choruses in their language, uh -huh. like in French or even sometimes I've attempted Japanese. So, do you want it, to give us a burst of any of those? Well, I know like uh, Konnichiwa, which is um, hello. Hello, yeah. Have you had a song called Hello? No, I haven't actually, but maybe we should do one together. Hello. We could do a line of Richie. Konnichiwa. Konnichiwa. Is <laughs> it me you're looking for? Do you know what I mean? Like, yeah, and I could say yeah. Just a little thought of Okay, let's, um, you're playing the Aquajet today, I Sam. Am. Is this the first time you've participated in water sports? Uh, no, I actually do jet ski when I go on holiday. I love uh -huh. that. This is the first time, obviously, I've been on a machine like this. I hope it's very similar. Okay, so after the break, we'll have Sam up on the Aquajet, and we'll have another climax on Mario 64 event. We'll be back quite literally in a minute. <laughs> Welcome back to Games Master. Well, for years I've been trying to make her come. Sam Fox, though, is finally on the show. We're very happy about that. She's about to play Aqua Jet. And I'd like to welcome back an old friend from last series, Mr. Derek Lynch, beside me in the comedy box. Okay, well, Derek, you are from Namco Wonder Parks. Uh, you know all about Aqua Jet. Give Sam some advice. Well, what Sam has to watch out for, as Aquajet picks up speed, just remember to lean, gra lean gracefully into those curves to keep control, and also to hit the ramps square in the middle. Okay, and thank you very much, speed. Derek. Sam has to get round one lap before her allotted time runs out. Best of luck, Sam. Off you go. Okay, we can see the time at the top of the screen. 34 seconds left. There will be time extensions as Sam gets through various stages in the course. Top left I corner, you can see a map and that details how far out the course she is. She's doing a good start, she's up to 10th place, but we're not worried about the placement there. We're just going to see a nice smooth ride. That's right, she has control there. She hasn't hit the side. She's moving quite well there, leaning into the curves, keeping nice control. That's great. She doesn't want to take the turns too wide though, because obviously that's going to, that's going to slow her down a little bit. That's right. But it's, it's going very well. Bit of a time extension there, 39 seconds left. Big jump coming up yeah. there. If she hits this jump, well, she's doing it well. Great. Straight on and then immediately into a right hander, but this is still okay. 30 seconds left. She can still do it there, Akashi. That's right, she can. If she's very careful between this cave. Okay, through the cave and... Uh, oh, where's the floor gone? Oh, she's under the water. water. She's <laughs> under the water. I thought we'd lost her. I thought I was going to have to dive in and apply mouth to mouth there, Derek. <laughs> <laughs> Will she get our time extension soon, Derek? Yeah, looks like she's going very well, handling the, the waves. Here we go, this is our time extension coming up. 30 seconds, I think that's our last one now, Derek. Okay, she's moving, taking this, this curve. Will she move, avoid those bo Yes, she has. That's great, no, it's almost a chicane there now. Jump contest, Derek. She wants to hit the big one straight on, doesn't she? She's done it. Yeah. Number two. Here's the first one. Number three, the third big one. Oh! Not quite on the small one, but that's still not bad. 11 seconds left to finish the race. I think it's just round this turn. Then the left hand, I think it's going to do it for the time. One of the closest challenges we've ever had yes. uh, on any series of Games Master. 
How, tell us how it felt then, going around wielding this huge big machine. <laughs> well, it, actually, it's, it's um, very realistic, I must say. Uh -huh. It's very close to the real thing. Um, uh, what about when you were coming near the end? Were you worried at any point you weren't going to do it? Yeah, I, well, the big jump when, when, you go, when I went under the water, I was, I was uh -huh. kind of thinking, well, how am I going to get out of this? But I, I lifted the thing up, I don't know what it's called, the, um, the handlebar. Things fine, handlebars. And um, I pushed them up and I seemed to come out of the water and it was, re it was really good. It's amazing what can happen when you lift things up. It, so. uh, you, you watch it, you. I'm going to... Um, <laughs> that wasn't bad. I managed to go about two or three questions there, Sam, without saying anything remotely rude. It's great. It's a sign of intelligence, you know. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you very much. And, uh, right, I'm not even going to try this now. Sam Fox has got the better of me. I'm going to bow out gracefully. Thank you very much for coming Thank on, you. Sam. Thank you. Cheers. And uh, you are uh, one of my favourite winners of the Golden Games Master Joystick! <laughs> Uh, we extend to all our guests here at Games Master is a very good indeed. So while I go and help Sam get changed, remember we have got the Mario 64 event still going on. We'll catch up on that after today's feature.